can see right now it's on the first floor, and if my assistant will come over here and look at the LEDs as it goes to each floor. Right now, since it is on the first floor, our green first floor LED is lit up. We also had to make it a theme, so we made it a Candyland type theme. And so, whenever we hit the second floor, let me switch, go straight to the second floor, third floor, go straight to the third floor, fourth floor, go straight to the fourth floor, fifth floor, straight to the fifth floor, and first floor, goes back to the first floor, and we can make it in any order, because of the programming we have coded, it will go and to any floor, regardless of where it is at the moment. Our elevator is five stories tall, plus a roof. And then, if we wait seven seconds, it should return to the bottom floor by, on its own. And the green LED at the bottom floor will light up, as it did. And here, as you can see, if we hit, for example, the fourth floor. We have a line follower so that whenever we touch the line follower, it has an emergency it has an emergency shut off, shuts off the escalator, and also returns the elevator back to the first floor. So if something were to happen, kill switch. Shuts off the escalator, returns to the first floor. We also have an escalator going from our second floor to the roof. And so, Gandalf the White can just jump on our escalator because it goes from the second floor to the roof. So he can just jump on. And we have little patios for him to get off at at each floor if he wanted to. But he's an inanimate Lego, so... Oh, man, Gandalf. Okay. And then... Nope. Just goes to every floor. Oh, little Twix bar waiting for him at the fifth floor, I see. Okay. Anyway. Next, he can go to the roof. And from the roof, he can get off at Candyland. And then, to get down, Gandalf simply has you to... Sit him. You gotta sit him down. Sit him. Gandalf simply has to hold on to one of the rolls. Ooh, one-handed. Gandalf's on the edge today. And our elevator is going at a speed of 15 at the moment.